Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back again with another video for you guys, this time, it's on another cologne here, this, one, this is a clone cologne, this is no other than Polo Sport, pretty sure you guys are familiar with Polo Sport, Polo Sport number 7, alright, out the top, the main of course in the original polo is what it look like right there. Bottle looks similar in color, but not in shape. Alright, the original polo sport main of course are aromatic, fresh spicy, citrus, green, and iodic. Iodic. Alright, this cologne was launched back in 1994. I right, said so the nose behind this fragrance is Hair Fremont. Top notes are out of hats, RMS, RMS, lavender, mandarin orange, mint, neroli, bergamot, and lemon. The middle notes are cosline, ginger, seagrass, jasmine, rose, Brazilian rosewood, and geranium. The base notes are saddlewood, amber, musk, jurant wood, and cedar. Yeah, it that's how we do it. Like I said, some people say it smells like polo, nut belts, smell like anime of the mail, Beverly Hill wings, and others. Uh, okay, I don't really get that. Smells a little bit like Beverly Hill wings, though. Come to think of it, uh, come to think of it, kind of do smell that way. Show you guys what the spray a little light. Here we go. Spray is pretty good. Um, not bad at all. Um, I'm just gonna sit something else there because the color was changing a lot with this type of box was there. But yeah, it does uh, smell really good with this uh, blue bottle was there. I'll just sit that box because it changed the color so much. So I'm going to just hold it in my hand. Uh, projection of this, I get about projection. I get about a good two hours of uh, good projection. Longevity, I get about six to eight hours. It's pretty good. I got about a half a bottle left here. This is one I had actually a while um, some of these clones that you see me with, a lot of times I don't know exactly where they come from or not. <laughs> I just be forgetting them. But 95% of the time, guys, I get my clones from like City Trends. City Trends going to be the best place to get your clones. Not only that, City Trends going to be the, mainly the cheapest place to get your clones from. Because honestly, they about the only ones I know. That carry really good clones, you know, uh, good, few pretty decent sprays on them and stuff. And like I said, yeah, City Train gonna be the best place to get them. They got another Polo clone in there right now that I should have got, which I'm gonna get if I can get back up there. Somebody might be beating me to it, but they had a Polo. Matter of fact, I'm gonna tell you guys the clone that they had because I seen it. They had the Ralph Lauren Polo Blue Sport clone in there, which I should have got. Hoping it's there when I go back. You know, I may go back a little sooner than expected because of, cause of this. I'm I'm going to call, I'm going to end up naming my channel King of Clones. King of Clone Colognes. Because <laughs> I got a lot of clones and. I got some name brands, but I got more clones than I do name brands. I got a lot of oils. You know, I might have 40, 50 name brands and 100 clones, you know. <laughs> so I got more clones because a lot of times my clones is what I started out with. You know, um, basically like when I started wearing colognes, I, I was the type of guy that will wear like let's say I will wear cool water and cool water will be the main cologne that I wear. I wouldn't do a lot of trading. See 
uh, back in like the middle nineties, you know, teenager and all that kind of stuff, you know, um, back then you 11, 12 years old, 13 at the most wearing colognes, you know, you had one cologne, you know, you couldn't get them like you get them now as a grown 30 some year old man, you know, you couldn't get them like you get them now, but back then, you know, you get a bottle of cool water and that's your number one cologne. And you wouldn't wear it every day. You know, you would wear it maybe like on weekends. No, through the week, you might would just take a good bath and just throw on some doggone something, you know, some body spray, some Axe body spray or whatever it was out at that time back then. But, you know, back in that day, you had a special time when you wore your cool water. And it wasn't every day, you know. You wore your cool water on weekends and stuff like that, you know. If you take your get it back then, I had girls then. You no, know, I did anyway. I had women when I was like 12, 13. So, hey, man, I was a cool dude, man. I had a lot, I had a lot of women in that day, man. Just five or six girlfriends. <laughs> so did. I was like, 13 going on 40. Back then, seriously, smoking black and miles and Newports and drinking the 40s or OEs were the thing back in the day, drink 40s. 13, 12 years old, smoking black and mild and drinking 40 ounce beers and five or six women. That was me with twisted up hair. <laughs> well, I was skinny back in that day, though. Had twisted hair and looking like Chris Rock. <laughs> Back in that day, hair twisted all up. <laughs> About 140, 50 pounds. <laughs> but yeah, guys, this is a good one right here. Uh, sport, it's Polo Sport. It's called Sport Club 7. I'm going to try to get that other uh, replica cologne for you guys. I seen it. I should have got it. I don't know why I didn't get it. Uh I, I, I enjoy doing the clone colognes for you guys because you guys can get them. Good spreads. Y'all may like them. They're strong enough. Some of them, you know, save you some money. It's really kind of like a sweet. This is a really sweet light right here. I like I like it. It's kind of sweet light, too. Smell really good. I like the bottle. They even make some cool bottles on these rubber colognes. Just sit them on your dresser. You know, the bottle itself alone is cool, you know. So, that's why I get a lot of replica colognes. Not only because that they're reasonable. Uh, I like them because of the simple fact that they're, you know, that, that they're, um, the bottle designs on some of them is really nice. Really nice. Really nice. All right. So, guys, well, uh, if you're new to my channel, uh, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with your family and friends. And uh, yeah, guys, uh, yep. don't be lifting too many weights. I almost pulled a muscle in my arm here. <laughs> Till next time, you guys take care. I'm going to hit y'all on the next one. I'm out. Peace.